to, to, to working leather is designed to be worn year-round and whether it's snowing out or whether it's 135 degrees out in the shade, you, you, it's designed for you to still wear leather. So it's a process to work oil and wax into leather. And you can see how that's like coming back. And I use all natural ingredients when it comes to working um, with the leather. And matter of fact, I'll grab another item over there that I actually utilize to basically just, and this is how you maintain your leather. You want it to last. That's why I can give a hundred year guarantee on my leather work because I'm going to not just make something, but I'm going to let people know how to maintain the leather. So, and the same thing, this is a, I love about working with leather, like I said, it's very hands-on work that you actually do. And all of these things that I'm working with are natural elements, so you know, I'm, that's why I'm not wearing gloves. You see me wearing gloves, it's going to be because I'm staining leather red or purple or black or something like that. But when it comes to these different waxes and oils that I'm using, they're all natural and they're all the same things that are in skincare products, uh, higher end skin skincare products, so it's, it's good stuff to use. Um, I've got another item I'll grab real quick. It's, a, it's not toxic stuff, but I can actually take this foam right here and spray it in my hand. I can take the same foam and just go over my leather. Oh, wow. Because it's that natural. <laughs> <laughs> so, and like I said, this is the, 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 the items that are in this leather, the items that are in this actual moisturizer cleaner are the same elements that are in the higher end skincare products. Wow. So, which is really, that's why I can, can we do this like this. And like I said, when you have people that are wearing your leather and they're only like two months old and everyone else, you want to have all natural products. So that's, that makes a difference. And you can see how that just came back to life as I put, the, put that moisture into it as far as the, some oil and then I'll work some wax into it. So, there you go. See how that pops now? Really just came back alive with the product while you're doing so. And that's just how it is when it comes to leather. You have to maintain it. You see how shiny it is now? That's the yeah, actual change up. The same thing, I, this is just beeswax, so same thing. I can start upgrading this oil because you have to put oil and wax to feed the leather. And like I said, the stuff will start shining. You'll see a reflection in it because it just, that's how you work it. And with it being like this, this is why I can work with any age group with leather because it's safe and this is a very hands-on and physical class and when you show people how to make snaps and put snaps in items, once they learn how to put snaps in the leather, then they can put snaps in the regular clothing and they put it into jeans and other material. So that's just that process. So, so when it comes to leather, it's very versatile, and uh, like I said, you see how that changed. Like you can see if you press the room nap, it's really shiny, and that's how you want your leather to be. So you have to feed the leather, oil, and wax, same thing, I just put this in my hand. As I said, it's just moisturizing, that's why my hand... You know, people are like thinking we got rough hands because I'm working with granite and metal tools and I'm, I'm getting moisturized. <laughs> I'm revitalizing leather. And the same thing, I can do this with purses and wallets and jackets, but you know, I'll pull the dirt out of them if I revitalize it. The same thing, <clears throat> I start to put the wax on. And you can see, see that changes. It's popping as it comes alive, same thing. This is just another bracelet, so same thing. And just work what's in my hands and under here. Just to bring it back. I'll put a lot of wax on it, but it's all here. Just it, same thing. You see how to work the wax. Oil. It's just 
que... different doesn't it <laughs> yeah it does it's super shiny <laughs> yeah so and that's what you got to do um yeah and these are all natural products this is a veggie can leather so, so, so in conclusion you have to feed leather for it to stay supple and shiny and Having that new look, new look with oil, natural oil, and beeswax. You know, so it's a process. Wow. Can you, um, like, uh, give us your social media platform, like your website? Yeah. My website is childsleather.com. C-H-I-L-P-S leather.com. You can Google artist Carl Childs. Google artist Carl Childs. All kinds of newspaper articles and TV and other stuff's going to pop up. So that way they can learn a little bit more about me. Uh, I'm here as an artist at Charlotte Art League. And uh, like I said, Charlotte Art League is, a, is an opportunity for you to connect with other artists and positive and venue here to get exposure and get some recognition and stuff here. We're here in the NODA area, so we're new to NODA for us. It's been a year now since we carried this in. We used to be up in South Bay. So we want to welcome all of our, our people that used to visit here and shop here that we're on this end of uh, the light rail. We're actually um, Sugar Creek stop on the light rail where you can see us. So there's a lot of awesome things to come here and see. And like I said, just stay connected with positive people. Be encouraged. Uh, speak life to each other. All those things are free to do. And especially as an artist, we can reach so many people in the world. Why not reach them with a positive message? Mm -hmm. Thank you so much. Okay.